My project focused on a disease called ALS. The full name is protein ALS. called SOX2. So my which job was to insert the gene to the virus and affect cells with it. Found out that there is a stem cell population right. in this ligament. That's the vector around. is like a uh, transport. Once you identify allows. microRNAs, which are good in at the beginning of this program, I didn't understand what working in a lab was like. I didn't know that much about stem cells before I entered into this program. We're here at the first annual CERM Creativity Awards poster day. Creativity Awards is a high school internship program uh, for junior and senior year high school students. A lot of the students come from socioeconomically disadvantaged backgrounds, a lot of underrepresented minorities. My mom, she was never like into science. She never finished grade school. My parents, they always tell me to push because I have opportunities that none of my brothers and sisters did. This really opened my eyes to working in a lab and just being a researcher, something I never thought I'd consider. This has definitely opened my eyes to the vastness of stem cell research. This just like gave me another reason to go for becoming a doctor. It's really amazing and I, I love this program that CERM is uh, as with our, these high school students. In this specific creativity program, um, Dr. Bauer is teaching us about film history. It really does kindle creativity to uh, have a multi-linear approach to learning as opposed to a just single dimensional one. And we're hoping to get the next generation of stem cell scientists who can think outside the box. I, th I think this program will make it easier for me get to get into colleges because now I have experience with the whole community giving to me all these opportunities. I hope in the future to give back to them. It's really cool and I'm, I'm excited and everyone, my mom, oh my gosh, she's really excited. I'm very proud of her um, and uh, at such a young age she's so motivated and we, we will all support her in any way we can to continue moving forward with her research interest in stem cells.